These schoolgirls in Lebanon are learning how to make colorful sanitary pads. Three out of four women here struggle to afford menstrual products. It's very important to me that girls my age have access to the sanitary products because at the end of the day they're a right and they shouldn't be a luxury. They're also trying to break down taboos. We're using these pretty cotton to destigmatize the period poverty issue in Lebanon. No one should be ashamed of speaking about their period. So do you want to go choose some pretty cotton? They're being trained by 23-year-old Ella from the UK. She started making these pads at home during lockdown and it's turned into a global charity. I started making these reusable sanitary pads and got other people making them and now we're distributing them to vulnerable people here in Lebanon. Many of the pads are given to women in refugee camps. You have people living in refugee settlements who don't have the products they need so they then maybe leak through their clothes. And because the stigma is so strong, they don't know how to ask because they're so scared of talking about periods in the first place. They last three to five years. If we can get these pads to as many people as we possibly can, then we can hopefully get rid of period poverty for people in Lebanon and then around the world as well. There you go, you've made your first batch of